All right. So make sure you can get in a comfortable position, whether this is sitting down or lying down. It doesn't really matter. Just make sure your back is straight. It's just very easy and comfortable for you. And once you get into this position, I want you to breathe in through the center of your back. And then breathe out. Breathe in again, breathing in that deep, purifying air. When you breathe out, let go of tension. Feel each time that you release air that your body gets more and more relaxed. Breathe in again through the center of your back. Really pull it in and let it out. All right, one more time. Breathe in deeply into the center of your tummy. And breathe out. And you are completely relaxed. And as you're in this state, I want you to imagine that you're standing under a waterfall of light. And this light is just showering all over you. Allow it to shower your entire body. Allow it to go through your mind. Allow it to relax and calm your thoughts. Make sure you continue to breathe easily through this. Let shower and go all the way down your entire body. And as you do this, I want you to start imagining yourself in a meadow, in a beautiful meadow. And as you look around you, you might notice the lushness of the grass. Maybe the grass is tall. Maybe you're surrounded by trees in the distance. And it's a beautiful sunny day, warm breeze. And you're going to get up and you're going to start walking into that forest in the distance. And with each step you take, the forest gets closer and closer until you're finally approaching the forest. And as you look at this beautiful forest, you notice so many beautiful trees. Trees that have been here for thousands of years. These are massive trees. And you start to walk in and be surrounded by these massive, ancient wise old trees and as you're wandering around you start to notice a lake in the distance so you come up to the lake and you look at it and it's so clear and pure and you just decide to jump in so you strip off all your clothes and you jump into the lake and as you jump in it's a cool Water just trickles all over your body. It's so refreshing and invigorating. You feel life enter you. And you splash around a little bit. And you feel the water. It just feels so easily. It, feels, it flows easily through your hands. And you're just jumping around. And you're swimming and doing underwater circles. And really just enjoying the beauty of this water. And all of a sudden you go underneath the water. And you realize that you can breathe under the water. So you decide to go further, further, and further down because you can breathe in this water. And as you walk around inside the water, underneath the water, you see a light in the distance. And this light is coming from a cave. And you go into the cave. You decide to swim towards the cave. And as you go in, you follow the light, the trail of the light that comes in from the other side of the cave. So you keep going, you venture further and further, following the light in the distance. And then you notice that the light starts to go up. You look up and you see that there's a spot where the water ends and air begins. So you swim up and you come up out of the water. And as you look out of the water, you notice you are in this beautiful garden, this mystical garden. It's like the Garden of Eden. And it's so vibrant. So you decide to get out of the lake. And as you get out of the lake, you see a tree with a lower branch of which you see this beautiful robe. It's this robe and slippers, and they were there waiting for you. So you get out, you put on the robe, and you put on the slippers. And as you get dressed, you notice that there are masters and guides and angels that are surrounding you. 
and you just feel so loved in the midst of their presence. They are here to guide you and they can be called upon whenever you need them. They love being called upon. They want you to know they're there and they start to guide you into this area where there are six different rounds of marble all going up towards a higher place. They're like these marble steps and they go higher and higher and you decide to step up onto the first step. So your masters or your guides or your angels, whoever is surrounding you, they help you step up on the first step. And as you step up to the first step, one of the angels takes away your slippers and you feel the cool marble underneath your feet. It's this beautiful, soothing, cool surface. And all the surface is where you get to release that area where you struggle with. That area where it seems difficult for you to let go of. It's this area where you are pretending that something is really real. Whether it's money, a struggle with money, and you think that this is real, you have a struggle with money, you're able to just let that slip away. Or maybe it's in a relationship and your ability or thoughts or beliefs about creating a loving, fulfilling relationship. You're able to release that. You, it doesn't feel real anymore. It feels more like it was a trance you were in and you're slipping out of this trance. I want you to imagine that your whole entire en energetic being is releasing the realness of whatever that struggle area for you is. It's not even real anymore. It's like waking up out of a trance and you're like, what was I thinking? And you step up to the next marble step and you feel that cool marble underneath your feet. And on this step, you just allow yourself to release the consciousness of limitation. Release the places where you are preventing yourself from letting your imagination fly, from letting your desires feel real to you. Release your expectation. Tell yourself that it's okay to want more. It's okay to have more. It's okay to dream of bigger. It's your birthright to expand. It is your natural state to be expansive, to dream of more, more love, better relationships, more money, more things that you can do. Not only with money, but with your freedom. And you feel whatever limitation you put on yourself, whatever you thought, no, I can't ask for that, or that's not possible. Whatever limitation you have, it slips away on this step. You release the consciousness of blame. Right here as you are on this marble, you claim a responsibility for your life and for what you are creating in your life. You release procrastination or any type of self-doubt or any type of self-punishment. Allow yourself to feel your desirability. Allow yourself to feel and really claim the consciousness of abundance. What does abundance truly feel to you? And if you feel that you've been putting a, a cap on abundance, release it. Let it burst open and explode into a million stars of a pure abundance. Feel that. Now take another step up to the next marble slab and just feel the coolness of the marble. It's so cooling and refreshing. And here you are going to release the meaning that you attach to money, to success and wealth. Ask yourself, what weight have you placed on money? Has it become a validation for your self-esteem? Do you feel better with money or do you use it to beat up on yourself when you don't have enough money? What have you given money the power of when it comes to how you feel about yourself or what you feel you can do? Imagine 
money as this energetic block and imagine that you're reaching in deep into your psyche and you are removing this energetic block and you're, you're placing it down on this marble. You're releasing it. Money is not real. It's a channel, but it's not the answer. It's not why you are creating the things you are creating. Allow yourself to release anything that you no longer want to have. Remember, money is not the reward you get for working hard or for being a good person. Release it. It means nothing. It's a block and you can take it out. Remove it. Remove this barrier. If this is the barrier, if this has been the barrier between you and your dreams, remove it. Release it. It's not a barrier. It's a channel. And it's one of many. Release this barrier. It's not real. And as you do this, take another step up onto the next slab. And again, feel the coolness of the marble and the lightness in your body as you continue to move up. On this next slab, this is where you claim your abundance. This is where you really allow yourself to feel abundant. Feel it going through your feet. Feel it going all the way up through your body. Feel it reaching your head and coming out the top of your head and it's surrounding you. You are surrounded in this cocoon of abundance. Really allow yourself to feel this abundance. Allow this whole entire step, this marble step to energize your entire being and just claim your abundance. Allow your Allow yourself to feel it. If you're at a six, yank it to a seven, then put it to an eight, then put it to a nine, put it all the way to ten. Just feel your body vibrating with the abundance that you truly are. You've released any blocks that have stopped you from allowing yourself to feel this. Pump up the abundance. Feel it pouring through your body. You are abundant. Claim it. This is where you get to claim it. Don't allow any barriers. If you feel thoughts coming up, well, I'm not abundant because of this, that, the other. Release it. Become expansive and abundant. And pump it up through your body. Claim it. And I want you to go up to the next slab. And on that next step, right here, claim what it is you want. What do you want in your life? What do you really dream of? This is where you get to really claim your dreams, your life, your relationships. What do you want? Claim it. You create it. You create it. What do you want with your spiritual connection to God? What emotions do you want to feel? Do you want to feel peaceful? Do you want to feel confident? Do you want to feel free? Do you want to feel more abundant? And if you're not sure what those would feel like, just simply asking allows the answer to come. Asking what would it be like to be even more peaceful? Just being open to that. What would it feel like to be more confident in every day, in every encounter, in everything you do, just to be confident in who you are? How do you want to feel in your career? Do you really want to feel successful? Do you want to feel like you are accomplishing, doing something that you really enjoy? Do you want to feel fulfilled? What do you want in your career? What do you want as far as money in your bank account? 
How much money do you want? Remember, money is not real. You've released it. It's not the cause. It's an effect. So how much money do you want? It's up to your discretion. What kind of social life do you want? Take this moment to gain clarity and get really clear. And then when these things start to show up in your life, or when other things show up in your life, it's just an opportunity to gain more clarity. So that way you can allow, you can claim what it is that you really, really want, what it is that will actually make you happy. So go for it. You know you are the creator of your own life experience. And you know you can create with ease and elegance and it can be easy and it can be fun. Claim that. And as you do that, step on the last marble slab, feeling that cool marble underneath your feet, feeling it just refresh your whole entire body. And here you know that you not already have abundance, but that you are abundance and you were born into a universe that was created out of abundance your body your whole entire life is created out of abundance God is abundance the universe is abundance and you are an aspect of that you are abundance come to life you are that ray of sunshine that beams from the everlasting sun, solar light. You are an abundant being that lives within and is a part of an abundant universe. That is who you are forevermore. So claim that right now. You have it right now. Claim it. And as you do that, start to come off this slab you're going to the other side of the staircase. And as you do that, you see an angel waiting for you. Or maybe it's a master or some sort of guide. And they're just waiting to celebrate you. Imagine yourself going in a circle. In, in the middle of a circle that is created by all your guides and all your angels and masters. They're all surrounding you and sending you light and love. And they're letting you know that this they are your team and they're ready to guide you into your next path. They're ready to guide you into the next chapter of your life. They are always here for you. Allow yourself to feel that love. Unconditional. Forever. Always there, love. If you need guidance, if you need strength, if you just need to feel loved, they're there. Whenever you need evidence of anything, call upon them. And they're right there for you. And they love being there for you. Notice right before you now that there's a gold shimmering door. And on this door is the symbol of abundance. And it's pulling you. It's pulling you towards it. Start walking towards that door. Feel abundance growing as you focus on that symbol. And as you walk towards the door and continue to focus on the symbol, you allow yourself to step through the door. And you just feel the energy as you step through the door and you close the door behind you. And you slowly start to find yourself back in the room where you are sitting in. You're back in the chair that you're in, or the bed, or the couch. And you breathe in deeply. Because you just went on an incredible journey. And you brought it all the way back here. Back into what you're making real. So put your focus back into the room. And wiggle your toes and your fingers. And when you're ready, you may open your eyes and live the abundance that you are. Congratulations. This is your graduation ceremony. Every moment from here on out will be at a new consciousness level. 
And every time you acknowledge that you are at a new awareness of your truth, of who you are, of your abundant state, of all the, all the opportunities and infinite potentials that are open to you, the more you acknowledge it, the more you will start to see it. Congratulations. Enjoy the journey.